Grace Towns. Ten minutes or less. I'm Jonas. I'm TNT Don. I might the explosive one. Let's start the timer. But ding. TNT. Yo. I was uh, checking out the internet, hmm. and I came across this video. Oh Jesus! And it <laughs> is the story. Uh-huh. It's a 22 year old girl who something happened to her when she was younger, and her pituitary gland got jacked up. So she looks like she's eight years old. Oh, but she's twenty two. Yes, and they, I've seen her. And I've I was like, well, and I was like, dude, this is effed up. I mean, like, and then I got, and then like, I was kinda. like, oh, let me check the comments on Reddit. First comment: Her DMs must be full of the weirdest mfers. And I'm like, how could you date that girl and not, without anyone just like thinking that you're like. A uh, pedophile? Yeah, because she looks like an eight-year-old girl, but she's 22 years old. Yeah, I mean, look, okay, so this just automatically makes me think of, like, Andy Milonakis. Do you remember him? I, yeah, I remember him. Yeah, remember, yeah he, he, he was around for, like, a cup of coffee. And remember, he had he had a similar issue, right, where he looked way younger than he was. Oh, is that what that was? I always just thought he was. I just always thought he was like a young guy. No, he had he had the issue. I think it was Andy Miller. Now, either way, I know there was a male who had similar issues, and he had trouble, obviously, finding a woman, which is you know kind of funny. But to to you know, much to her chagrin, I'm sure, is that the majority of the guys that are going to hit on you are going to be weird because because like yeah because yeah. like it's just like yeah. I just couldn't even imagine yeah. Like, yeah, because they're they're going to be attracted to you because you look like you're a child. And that's just the thing. It's because men are attracted to the visual and women are attracted to the mental. Women are definitely not attracted to the mental. Not they are until, a thousand until, percent attracted right, to physical. You're, okay, look, so women are attracted to the physical until they get uh, into enough bad relationships where they're like, I need somebody who I can respect mentally. Once they've had a couple kids, yeah, red pill. I don't care. Once they've had a couple kids and they've been had their heart broken a bunch of times, then they're like, I don't care what a guy looks like as long as he treats me right. So that comes I mean, later. You're, I mean, I mean, yeah. It may okay. not be as extreme as what you're saying, but yes, I agree. I got the basis. I, now. I agree that like, well, yeah, because like the girls, like they will go after like the bad boy guy, and then they're all yeah. like, wow, all those guys. They might be hot, but they treat me like crap. They do blah, 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 blah. And then they're like, oh, yeah, maybe if I go for a dude who may not be the hottest, but yeah. wow, he treats me good and he's nice to me. Hey. Like, yeah. Hey, yo, you know what? Salute to the, all the captains of the football team putting miles on these chicks and then sending them my way, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I like you're, like, with, you're like, like, and then I get them when they have careers and have money. Yeah, I like them with a couple miles on them. You know, a kid that's just like you know, two, three years out of until he's out of the house. I love that. Bring that on to me. Oh yeah, yeah is, that, is that is that your demographic? <laughs> that's my jam. I like them. I like a girl who's ridden hard and put away wet. I like Jesus, them. you're getting a little red pill. I like them. I like them with a couple of stab wounds and bullet holes. I want a oh. I want a chick that's Wednesday night at the strip club. All what right? about what about the guys? What kind of guys you like? What are you talking about? <laughs> I'm what just trying we... to see. Give it equal opportunity to the I'm the, not, the no. men with with the dad bods I, and look, the. I, I don't care whoever bullet holes. Whatever, whatever your choices are in life, that's you. Whoever you choose to love, I'm not getting in the way of love, but not me. I'm good. Yeah, no, but like I just feel bad for this girl because yeah, like I feel like like a regular dude who's not like a weirdy, creepy, likes kids guy mm-hmm. is like even if like they he started talking to her for all the right reasons and like it's like how are you not how can you go anywhere together how can you like i I remember when we were talking i was like i was telling you uh we were talking about kids or whatever and i was like yeah i just try to spend the majority of my life trying not to look like a pedophile i imagine going out on a date with this girl and everybody's gonna be like uh excuse me sir like you're gonna get you like you're going you're inviting like uh confrontation yeah oh yeah man like if i saw some dude kissing on this chick who looks like she's eight i'm like hey buddy 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 what's going on right here right like it's one thing if you're walking through the mall holding hands because like a dad will hold his daughter's hand as they're walking through the mall but you wouldn't want that to be the optics that you're putting out right right. and then and then then you like reach down and like they're all like oh you're gonna think like you go and like just give her a full-on mouth kiss and everyone's like grab her butt cheek everyone's like what the (laughs) is going on like there would be some man out there that would that would do exactly what you said they would come up be like yo 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 what the hell are you doing man like white knight is gonna say something some white knight dude oh white knights 
So, but that's, you know, and honestly, and that's probably like, I wouldn't say the least of her issues, but you got to think of all the other issues, man. Like, what if you just want to have a drink? Like, that's, that's, a I whole... mean, even with an ID, I'm sure it's going to be hard exactly. to like pass that. Exactly. Like, does she have to have like a news story about her too? Like, okay, here's my ID and then here's my news story so you can like yeah. prove that I'm actually like a 22 year old. Like, girl. I'm sure she probably carries around like a manila envelope with a bunch of different. <laughs> If yeah, it would just proof. be, man, that would just be a hard F in life. Like, dude. what if you want to get a, what if you want to buy a car and you're like out by yourself? I'm going to go get this car. Yeah, you're driving around and everyone's like, yeah. there's a child, drive, the cops pull you over. Like, dude, her life is hard for, like, I mean, women already have it hard out there. But like looking like a child at 22 and yeah. being a woman out there, like she's, she's got some rough stuff going on. Is, in it, her life, is it wrong for me to say is that she's an attractive young lady too? <laughs> I mean, is it? No, because she's twenty two. I mean, she, it, subjectively, she is easy on the eyes. But like, yeah, we're we'll have to check your internet history oh, there. <laughs> but like, yeah, man, it was. Uh, it, 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 and she and like, I would just imagine that like, she would have like you would. She's probably just like super kind because like I'm sure like eh, you know she's a person. I mean, no person really deserves to have that. It's just one extra layer of bull crap that we have to go through uh, throughout life. And women had enough bull crap because they just, you know, they walk around scared as it is. And if you look like a child, no, now you got to be afraid of like the rapist and the uh, child sex. Yeah, so he's going to try to offer like you that. candy in a van or what? I, dude, it's just, I just. I... <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Hey, yo, but benefits. What are some? Yeah, of the well, yeah. Let's let's not be uh, hey, let's yo. not be completely. She uh, she years gets old. she gets cheaper meals at restaurants. Uh, she, she probably could. She gets the kids. She has a smaller she stomach. Gets the kids meal. Wow. So like this so, is like mad disrespectful, but I'm all about it. I let's mean, I'm going. not trying to be ugly. <laughs> I mean, that's a benefit, no, it's right? Hilarious. Don't I mean, me, it is a benefit. It is a benefit. She can have all the Dino Nuggets that she wants. Yeah, dude. no one's gonna judge her. She's eating candy for breakfast. Hey yo. Only twenty two year old I know that can still get get away with with Halloween trick or treating. Boom. Oh, ooh, Candy. that's nice. Yeah, right? yeah. Because look, I'm gonna tell you right now, if I could go trick or treating right now and just like hold a bag out and get some, ca- I'm doing it. I would dress like Spider Man right now, but obviously I'm <laughs> six foot three. So. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, aren't you a little old? You're like, nah, I got a growth spurt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got this. Look, I got my manila envelope. Oh, I'm really, I'm really seven, <laughs> yeah, but I grew really fast. Yeah, uh, what, proof what a couple of news benefit. articles about me. So uh, this is like it's like opposite Benjamin Button type thing. Yeah, right? yeah. She, uh, she can't. She doesn't have to worry about sitting in the middle seat in an airplane. Oh yeah, being compact does help, man. Yeah, being compact. Oh, she does could help. like she could like when she goes to the airplane, she could be like pretend like she's one of the kids traveling alone, so she gets to board the plane first, sit up uh, front. She's like, my mommy's at home. Can you help me? Wow, yo, you look, man. And while took, are all of her benefits pretending to be a kid? You took God. you, you took me. I mean, all of her detriment is because she looks like a kid. Yeah. yeah. You just took me to a whole nother level when you told me that she could say my mommy says something. And I was like, there's no way I would ever let her call me daddy oh, or God, mommy no, or nothing. None of I those words. Mommy could... sexually. I meant like her. I, I know, like... but that's where my mind went. She's 22. I'm allowed. Yeah, dude. It's just I, I dude, uh, I was just trying to think about like if, if, if the situation was reversed and that was me and I looked like an eight year old boy, eight. If, you know, old man Jonas sitting here looking like an eight year old boy, just being like TNT, and I'll have a high voice in ish because I didn't grab like TNT. What do you think about yeah, Nyquil a, chicken? Yeah. And you're like, on the same note, any woman that was like, I need to date you, I'd be like, Are you sure? Let me check your Google. Right, history. dude. Like, who the hell could you date? Who would you feel safe dating? Uh, that is the question. The safe? Nobody. I mean, I don't feel safe dating people. No, but like. <laughs> In this situation, yeah. if you were this girl, who, how could you feel safe dating anyone? Nah, yeah, yeah. There's always going to be like that question in the back of your head. It's like, are you dating me because of this? Yeah. I mean, I guess there's always that question when you're dating someone, like, why are you dating me? But like <laughs> with her, yeah. her question is very valid. I just really hope that she doesn't let that st- stop her because there's definitely somebody out there that could look past that and not look at it as and a not fetish. be a creepy weirdo too. Yeah. yeah, because okay, so 
we tend to fetishize things that we are attracted to in the opposite sex. I've definitely been dated because I'm black by mad white girls who are like only date black dudes. And I'm like, oh, so you fetishizing me. Do I care? Not really. Some <laughs> some girls right. like fat guys, so they'll date fat guys. Some girls like, you know, a redhead, so they'll date redhead. Oh, I really like her red hair turns me on. And that's why we're dating. That's why we're married. But, you know, personality yeah. ends up taking over. But I hope she can find somebody that doesn't fetishize her because she looks like a eight year old girl. Like yeah. Yeah, yeah, dude. Yeah. It's just a tragic life for her. I just thought that was crazy. Like, I just couldn't even fathom. So, yeah. anyways, go to thecrazytown.com and subscribe for Jonas. TNT. Oh, yeah.